everybody, I'm Katie. I'm a huge Animal Crossing fan, so I'm attempting the Nico Challenge, where I create a dream vacation home for every single villager in the game, and I do that in only 365 days. Today is day 12 of the Happy Home Paradise Nico Challenge. I've already completed 19 villagers, and today's villager loves the outdoors and wants to share it with others. Leopold asks for a camper's paradise, and after taking a look at the items that he's looking for, I decided that this area was going to be someplace where all the kids could come and enjoy the camping experience, and maybe they could spend a few nights, but mostly it was going to be a modern style. I picked an area that had the evergreen trees and a lot of water and looked like it could be a great place for a wilderness camp and started working on the layout for the outside. I wanted it to have a really good cabin feel and a lot of area that looked as if people, specifically youth, were going to come and play and enjoy the outdoors. The main floor of the inside of the cabin is a little bit of a community room and it looks like a ton of chaos. I wanted it to mismatch a little bit. I wanted everything to look as if it was lived in and used. I wanted this area to look as if it was old, but it had been updated and filled with all the different activities and parts of life and playing and hanging out outdoors. So it has pets and snacks and games and different things to entertain the children. Upstairs is where the kids would bunk and then it has a row of bathrooms. And I really wanted this room to be super uniform and look more like a dormitory style. If the kids were all gonna have have their own little cubbies and spaces. That's sort of the look that I was going for up here. And it was pretty tricky figuring out how to space things out and get all the walls put into place so that everything fit just right. But once I figured out the spacing, I feel like the room really came together. My favorite part about creating Leopold's build was putting together areas that seemed really realistic and lived in, as if the kids had maybe just left for the day. I think Leopold is going to make an excellent camp director, and now that the camp is ready for the kids to come and hang out for the summer, I think it's time we invite a few of them to come and enjoy the area. Pecan also works at this particular camp and helps Leopold to organize and entertain the children and take care of all the needs that they have. She has her own vacation home that we will be doing another time, but she does spend a lot of her days here at the campsite. With that, day 12 is done. Only 393 villagers and 353 days to go to complete this challenge. I hope you found something useful here and continue creating in this game. Until next time, have the best Animal Crossing day.